Lauren Ziva with me now from The Knitting Nest. How are you? Good, thank you. Good, good to see you. Good to be here. Yeah, you brought in some springtime I colors. I did, yeah, it's spring. Now we can shift all the bright colors, yeah. you know, all the fun, like your necklace, I love that. Um, and yeah, it's like spring, it's still knitting. Uh -huh. We can still knit, there's plenty of fibers and things to do in the springtime, but it's all about the bright colors now, or you know, in the softer yarns, things Yes, like that, so. I was just feeling this yes. one right here. Yeah, so there's, you know, I carry a lot of cotton and silks. I mean, there's still the wools, some of the wools, the way that they're actually made are more mm -hmm. breathable, mm -hmm. so they're not scratchy. Um, but yeah, there's so much to do still with knitting, even though we're shifting into warmer weather, so. Yeah, what you're wearing is beautiful Thank you. as well. Thank you, and see, it's kind of this open, you know, knit, so uh -huh. it's not heavy and tight, It's and it's also faster that way. It's a lot of open holes, big needles, or drop stitches, things like that, that kind of make a nice little, you know, a shawl, or a little, you know, a little chalet, a little capelet, thinking. Right. Yeah. Well, something that you can add some color to. I mean, yes. I love what you've done with your outfit today. Well, thank you look you. awesome. Thank but you. But fun to put something together like yeah. that that will go with anything. Right, right. And it's still kind of chilly. I mean, it's warmer mm -hmm. now, but we still, you know, you still want something over your Feels shoulders, good. around sure. your neck. Up against your chest, yeah. of course. It's like sitting in the sun is really warm, but then you get in the shade for a second and <laughs> it's like, oh, okay, it's actually still spring. We're not in summer yet. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> So you have patterns for this at yes, the Knitting Nest. Yes, tons of patterns. Um, a lot of yarns, too. You know, there's free patterns that come with it. And so, um, and I have samples and everything that you can see. So come in and you see a yarn you like, and then there's a pattern that goes with it. So it kind of takes away the guesswork, figuring something out. Yeah. yeah so. And you have neat bags like this I as do. Well. I always love to bring bags in because it's like you know at a yarn shop that there's knitting, there's yarn, there's books, there's things. But And these are actually um, knitting bags. But they don't have to be. I mean, you know, this is a great little purse. Um, this yeah. is a great travel overnighter bag, but it does fit in your knitting projects. Mm. Um, and this company, it's all Atenti bags, but they're um, <laughs> um, they're made locally in California, and um, they kind of work either way, knitting or just you know. And they're great gifts too. So if you're looking for something for somebody and you're not sure what to get them, a bag is. Ever, I mean, women always love bags totally. and purses, and I can fill everyone I have. Yes, of course, of course. <laughs> and they all have a purpose. <laughs> yeah. So how long do people end up spending in your spot? Good question. I mean, I have people kind of come in and they know what they want. They're looking for something specific um, and they just kind of go straight for it or they kind of peruse the store. And then I have people stay there over an hour, an hour and a half. You know, they're just having a good time. It's kind of peaceful in there, sure. you know, and, and it's kind of get those creative juices flowing. So um, you can see different different color combinations and different things and it's like oh and I mean maybe even looking at this bag you say oh I might wear that as clothing you know I might mix some gray with a bright orange you know oh. something you never even think about doing but seeing kind of it is uh, you know lots of colors and fiber mixing so so fun yeah it is fun yeah how uh, that, where are you located and how long have you been there so I've been there almost 10 years in this fall it'll really? be 10 years yes I know it's flown Congratulations. by Congratulations. thank you Thank you. And so I'm at the top of Kingsbury. I'm inside of the Eagle's Nest Resort. Um, and it's really easy to find. It seems kind of, you know, obscure, but it's not. You just, it's off the main road, take Kingsbury grade. My website has directions. You can always call me, shoot me an email. Hey, how do I get there? Um, and my email, it's, I mean, my email, my uh, website is great. It has my hours, um, okay. all my information. Great to call ahead and make sure that I'm there, you know. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much yeah, for stopping by. Me. <laughs> we will be back. 